Yo, what's up? Bob here. So last week, we started working on the rhythm tracks for a song called Memento Mori, um, guitar rhythm tracks. And this week, we're going to do the guitar solos, overdubs, harmonies, uh, double tracking, and things of that nature. Okay. And I'm going to show you uh, from start to finish kind of how it all works. So what happens first is Bean sends me the track via text message. And here it is. It's on my iPad and then I just play it. Right? Okay, so then I take my iPhone and I open it up to the voice memo area, right? And I just get my guitar here. Oops. And um, as the track's playing, I just play along to it. Right? And then I record it on my phone like this. So I basically worked the whole solo out um, because, you know, it's one thing um, to play live and improvise and, and um, you know, play all your licks and stuff and everything. But when in a recording situation where time is of the essence, you want to be prepared. You don't want to go in there like a rookie and not be able to, to execute. So I have Bean send me the tracks. I spend some time working up the guitar solo and uh, ideas for the harmonies and double tracking and then we're going to get together and we're going to do it. Um, be using, uh, you know, instruments you've seen before, 1965, 335 and this old yellow telly right here. This 1965 AC30 made by the Vox. As far as pedals go, we're going to be using the Peak Cornish G2 and the Vimurum Jan Ray, and we use those together. So, let's do it.
sounds good. That's much better. Sounds fucking badass. <laughs> Yes. Ha, 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 ha. 